Good morning, my friends, and happy Easter. I hope your weekend and more importantly, your Easter are just tremendous. Now, I hate to do this to anyone on an Easter Sunday, but had to be done because you know what the case of little Quentin Simon does to me. This week, the judge who I just adore, she's not playing ball, but she's extremely fair, is going to be listening to a motions hearing. Leilani's going to be there, from my understanding. Her attorney, of course. They want several of her charges thrown out. They say because they are imperfect in form. They are saying that the state failed to allege any manner of death, any manner in which any cruel and excessive physical pain was inflicted, or the nature of the object, the weapon that she used. I don't think this is going to fly. This isn't our first rodeo in the first circus we've watched around here, and we know that the probable cause is their weakest evidence. When they went to the grand jury, they got indictments on all this stuff. They're giving her her defense. That's what they should be doing. I don't think anything's going to come of it. I think the judge is going to say, nope, it all stands. It, it's all there. You want, them, what, you want them to drop the charges and then pick them back up later? I mean, what do you want to do? The judge knows what's up. She, she's, uh, I'm sure, fully briefed by the estate's attorneys. Look at this with me and let me know what you think. They also do mention in this clip that his remains are still not back with his dad. That was quite a whopper, we were told a few months ago. Look at this, leave me a comment, and have a wonderful, wonderful day. New developments, attorneys for Lilani Simon will be back in a Chatham County courtroom next Friday for a motions hearing. Simon's attorneys are asking the court to throw out seven of the 19 charges the mother is facing. Four of the seven charges are for lying to police. The other three are murder charges, Simon's attorneys say. The Chatham County District Attorney's Office failed to provide enough information in the eight-page indictment for them to defend the three murder charges. Simon is accused of killing her 20-month-old son, Quentin, in October of 2022. Police believe she put his body in a trash dumpster at a mobile home park near her home. Now the toddler's remains were found more than a month later in a Chatham County landfill. Those remains are being examined by the Georgia Bureau of Investigation. For more on this case, including a timeline of events, visit WS.